Welcome to War Thunder with Subdude. How y'all doing tonight? Well, interesting fight. The F3H2 demon is still, in my opinion, broken as far as its flight model goes. My opinion of broken and your opinion of broken may differ. If you don't like my opinion, tough. I don't care. It's sloppy work. Model's beautiful. Other than the fact that there are still issues with the rudder going the wrong way, the air brakes on the wings opening as spoilers rather than as air brakes. Um, beyond that, it's a good plane. It does what it's supposed to do. It kills planes. And I can kill planes with missiles and guns. The last video I put up proves that. And this video pretty much will too. Sit back and enjoy the ride. We'll uh, be in the air momentarily. After taking off in the F3H Demon, what you want to do is you want to turn to the opposite direction of the airfield that you're going to be receiving the enemy from. Now the reason is, you gotta climb. I don't care what you think about, you know, going in low and fast like uh, an F86. This is not an F86. This is a plane that you need to get some altitude with. It was a fleet interceptor, which means it used to go after the big boys, the bears. It would be the plane that would go out to meet the bear. It would climb quickly, it would get up to the bear, and it would sit there on its wing going, Hi guys, how you doing? Well, the Russians inside the plane would be holding up Pepsis going, Yay! Capitalism, yes! But, in this game, you need the altitude. You can see here, we've got 104. 104s are a stone cold pain in the butt. They're fast. If you know how to play a 104, it's dangerous. It's very dangerous. So, the best way to deal with a 104 is get above him because most players are going to go down low. So, this is what I'm doing I'm climbing out. Go out to the south on this map. Climb high, turn in, and start looking for opportunities. Keep your eye on bad man down. He might not live through the match. Well, I know he doesn't live through the match. But from here on, the action pretty much gets started. So, enjoy, have fun. We'll see you in the sky.
at this point with damage to my wing, I was like, I don't think I really want to tangle with a highly maneuverable G91, especially one that might have 30 millimeters. So I was going to go back and land. Well, that only lasted for so long. Guns, guns, guns! And that was the match. I got the last kill. And that was pretty much it. Now, for those of you that uh, still think that I don't know what I'm doing with a F3H, Take care, folks. Have a nice night.